Okay, so this is pipe stone equipment, and we're here in our shop getting ready for a uh, pretty big shipment going out for us. We've got a couple of 24-inch uh, butterflies and a 130-inch. These are Valmatic uh, class 150 butterfly valves, and these are control valves going to a private industry project. And so we've got pneumatic actuators manufactured by Kinetrol that are going to be operating the valve. The actuators are these yellow things on top of the valve. And uh, what we'd like to do is kind of show some of the features and parts of the assembly. We'll start at the bottom with the valve itself. Like I said, this is a class 150 butterfly. This is the body and this is a disc. Right now the valve is in the fully open position. The operation of this valve in the plant is going to be fully open or fully closed. So in order to do that, we have an actuator, which is this device here. And this is the piece that opens or closes the valve. This particular actuator is made by Kinetrol. It's a pneumatic actuator, which means it's air operated, and it's double acting, meaning that we put air on one side to open the valve, or we'll put air on the other side to close the valve. The way we do that is by putting our air supply into this device here. This is a dual acting four-way solenoid valve. So we have our air supply. We've got two coils, one that will open the valve, one that will close the valve. And then the exhaust comes out here, which is adjustable. For this particular assembly, we've adjusted the valve so the full stroke operation is about 60 seconds. And then at the end of the full stroke, you'd like to get indication back at the main control panel if the valve is in the fully open or fully closed position. That's done with this device up here, which you see is coupled to the actuator. This is our limit switch. Right now the limit switch is showing in the open position, which matches the disc, is in the fully open position. And inside of this limit switch enclosure are a set of contacts that the owner will wire to, and that will give them indication that the valve is either fully open or fully closed. So right now we're set up for our final uh, test. We've tested the valve operationally for fully open and fully closed. We have the uh, speed control set at roughly 60 seconds, and we're going to do the final operation to bring the disc to the fully closed position, and we'll wrap it all up and we're going to put it on a truck. So here we go. So that's pretty much it. The uh, valves are ready to ship now. They'll go out today. They'll be delivered to our project site in New Mexico. And hopefully our good customer at CRG International, Cap Rio, will like this product. Thanks for joining Pipestone Equipment. You have a great day.